promise you, delete people you that I use this in your phone book. You will take better pictures. Book. Book. Hi guys, welcome to another video. First video of the year 2024. Happy New Year, everybody. And I really hope that you stick around. Um, did I say I'm Madam Mommy? I'm Madam Mommy. Please stick around. Please hit the subscribe button. Please um, engage down below. I do everything lifestyle, motherhood, plugs here and there, and we drink champagne while we're doing it. Okay. So today's video is all about actually my reflections, but I want to share with you guys because it's a new year and there's some things that gotta go. So let's talk about what are those things that gotta go in the new year. Okay, so I'm gonna start guns blazing. So number one on the list, your toothbrush, the one from last year, mm. check it out. Please change your toothbrush in the new year. Go do it now. Go change your toothbrush now. One thing you must check out in the new year is your old toothbrush. After that, you can also check out your you know the thing you used to bath? Leon, uh, Leon, Leon, what do you call it? The scratch. Ah! I. There's definitely not that. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna put the name here. That thing? Let's change that thing. Today, guys, let's change those things. Today, that thing is not coming within the new year. Okay? Another thing you must check, check in this new year is your old makeup. Ow. When was the last time you actually just revamped and just reviewed your makeup collection and said, okay, maybe this could have expired by now. All those things, girls, ladies, and gents. Let's check them out. Okay. I think that's item number three. Item number four that you must check out is old clothes. You know, old socks. Everything that you haven't worn the whole of last year. You're not going to wear this year. So you keep it. Check it out. You know, give it to somebody, donate it, whatever. Same goes for kids' clothes. If you've got kids, check it out. You know, donate. There are people who can use those clothes. But you're probably not dressing your kids in those clothes because you don't want them to dress in those clothes now. So, why are they in your closet? Like, why? Like, like what? what is the reason? Hmm? Check it out. Also, why are you hoarding? Why are you hoarding? Ipa, Lasa. And not just the makeup, your like your lotions, whatever. You know, sometimes you get those samples from shops. You're not gonna use those things. You're probably not gonna use them like this year because you didn't use them last year. So keeper, lasa. In fact, get a bin. You see, while you're watching this video, pause, like the video, subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Share the video, comment, and then go get the big black bag and start putting those things right now together, me and you. Why not? Let's do it now. Okay. She writes your song. Your earrings, your jewelry, 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 right? If they start chipping or they start this thing does it is no longer like the same color. If it starts becoming that green thing, you know what I'm talking about. You know it. You've probably seen it in your one of your one of your earrings. Lasa. Seguto de Mangelo. Segu say it has a de Mangeleo. Lasa. In the new year. 2024, we are the Okay. Um in the kitchen, you know those chopping boards. The ananisi, whatever, 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 whatever. If it's plastic, that in fact, I just recently discovered would it, if you keep on cutting on that plastic and then you, you, you try and ooh, like you, you put your veggies like in your pot, whatever, whatever you're doing, you're actually just uh, scraping the plastic as well, which is not actually good for, for, for us. So if you've got those cutting boards, Lasa, and then you can get yourself a nice um, wood. I'll show you guys also in the picture. So Lasa, okay. In your garage, guys, if there are boxes where you haven't even gone to that box for the entire year. You don't you don't even know what's in there. So don't even open it. Why vuna we vula? Just lasa. Lasa. Clear your space. Clear your closet. Clear your clean. Just 
first is calling upon there you know we can we're gonna keep the inside you know but it's outside let's just clear let's clear i see as a situation you understand yes um and then now we're gonna get into your heart your relationships oh sorry your relationships um it's painful for me but i've had to realize over the couple of years that actually it's true when they say sometimes you must just clear your contact details you understand in terms of you, your contact your phone book you understand you know if you haven't called someone in like a year probably not gonna call them if they haven't called you <laughs> they're probably not gonna call you so clear you know those things eat space on your phone you understand if you want to take nice pictures you mustn't have people who are wrong on your phone i promise you delete people do that are useless in your phone book and you will take better pictures book book and you'll come back and tell me here down below so do a thorough cleansing also as all of your contact who are you spending time with uh what are you talking about how do you feel after speaking spending time with them all those things count because everything that we are we are actually a part of us is because of the people that are around us and same goes with somebody else so what energy this person giving me um you know where that is where do i see this relationship going if you can't answer the question and they haven't called you in six months now we haven't just this month i hope i'm making sense also uh let's also get rid of our fear of starting something new i had this thing this problem for a long time over the past couple of years i think i overcame it last year when i started this youtube channel but i had this thing of you buzz or tin just one now i'm posting a video it's getting one like yo buzz or tin so what so what everybody starts somewhere you know but if you don't start you're never gonna start and if you start you're not gonna be uh an overnight success it, that's it's hardly ha it hardly ever happens like that look at snare underscore google zizi moloko i mean guys i can name a lot of people that for me personally i've seen as inspiration where they they actually just overcame their fear and they started talking to the camera like i'm doing now and they actually change other people's lives so i'm really hoping that i do that for you also today and if i do that for you please subscribe down below please share the video because in this new year we are changing our lives and we're taking control and the devil is a liar and the devil is not going to tell us we can't because we can because god says we can okay anyway that's the video i've got for you today if you enjoyed this video please 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 subscribe to my channel please um comment down below let me know actually which part of the video you enjoyed and also um share the video so that youtube can see that you actually enjoy and maybe more people can enjoy this video till next time bye